Alright y'all, just finished packing. We are now ready to start an eight hour journey to Reading to go see Dreamcatcher. All the things that I do to go see my favorite groups. <laughs> Drive eight hours to a place just to get uh, and watch them. But hey, I am prepared to do that. Uh, cause I mean, I just love them that much, you know? Um, but yeah, I'm really, really excited. The concert is tomorrow, so I've got all the time in the world to get there and I have to get there exactly in eight hours, you know? Um, but, uh, yeah, it's gonna be a fun little journey and I'll see you guys once I get in Reading. It's probably gonna be dark at that point. <laughs> Anyways, Dreamcatcher, here I come. Alright y'all, I made it. I made it safely to um, to Reading for DC concert. Just got in, I got myself a nice shirt. This one's wet by the way, like we waited in line and a freaking storm hit. So we got like really wet, uh, but I mean it's worth the wait, alright? Hopefully it's worth the wait. I, I'm, I'm assuming it's gonna be great, but um, yeah. Now it's just, it's it's all about the show now. I probably won't record everything. I want to enjoy myself. Well, I'll record bits here and there. Maybe even use uh, some footage from my friends even. Uh, but for the most part, I'm just going to enjoy myself. Record a few things uh, for you guys. So you can at least see how it was and how amazing it was. Or bad, it could be bad, but uh, <laughs> stream catchers could be absolutely amazing. So, yeah, DC, let's go. Yeah. 
I wish I had a voice. Oh, it's not even 
And just when we thought it was over. What's happening? What's happening? The girls are there. The girls are there. Oh, let's go! What?
And thus ends a beautiful and amazing concert. But that wasn't the end for me. No, 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 no. And it involves this right here. So yes, my friends went back to the hotel, but I went down and joined a line. That's right, the line for the high wave. Now, I will show you the clip of my high wave, but just know at that point, I look back at it and it's like, yeah, you can tell I am exhausted and my brain just malfunctioned and I just ended up saying the girl's name, except for when I saw Gio. Anyways, enjoy the clip. I love you. Hello. Dami. Gion. Anon. I love Spa. Gio, I love you. I love you. Shion. Alright y'all, I just did the freaking high wave, I didn't expect, I didn't know what to expect at that point. <laughs> I lost my voice by the way, I said to myself I wasn't going to scream because whatever sickness I had before, like the last week, completely destroyed my vocal cords. And I was like, yeah, I'll, I'll just take care of my voice and not scream or anything. You saw the videos, you saw the videos, you saw what I did, I didn't care anymore. But I started screaming. Um, yeah, and then we did the high wave. I didn't expect. I, I didn't know what to expect. But I, I, I got to see them up close. They were behind a screen. I mean, you're going to see the video. But, <clears throat> yeah, so we just said hi and said, I, I, you know, that I loved all the girls, you know. And uh, they're a lot shorter than I thought up close. But the show was absolutely freaking amazing. Seriously, bro, no, no bro. All right, hold it, hold this for me. I'm just finishing a vlog, bro. Bro, I did the high wave. How'd they go? I mean, they were behind the like a thing, but you just like you, know, you pass by like really quick, and you're like, hi, love you too, <laughs> bye, hi. Any good, good responses? Uh, dude, you freaking did like a finish my heart because I did like a half a heart. Oh. Anyways, but okay. All right. I'm gonna finish the party off by having something to eat. Alright, later. And yes, as you can see, I returned back to the hotel. And the hotel was actually doing like a barbecue type thing uh, outside. So I ended up grabbing something to eat uh, and a good old beer and went and sat down with friends. We were chatting uh, with other people as well, not just friends, but strangers that also attended the concert. And yeah, talking about our experiences and whatnot until I look at the corner of my eye and I'm like, is that, is that Yuhyun? Is that Yuhyun coming straight at us? And yeah, it was. It was freaking Dreamcatcher walking straight at us. And um, yeah, they were coming back from the event. And yeah, so we, we were just there sat eating and then we started interacting with Dreamcatcher. Uh, I, w I mean, I was thinking of uh, filming it, but I was like, at this point, you know, they're finished being idols, they're just normal people, they're finished their job, they want to go back into the hotel room and whatnot, so we're just like, just, we're gonna say hi, and we also said a big, big, big thank you, and, uh, you know, what an amazing concert they, ha they held, um, and wish them the best for their upcoming events, you know? Um, so yeah, and we kind of interacted that way, and at that point, I think Sua was also filming something, I don't know if it was a vlog or something, but she was filming herself, and then like, she, she like, <laughs> turns the camera with herself in front of you and us in the back, and we just started hyping up, listen, it was kind of a crazy event, um, for by the fact that I paid for a high wave, and we ended up getting something kind of, in my opinion, a lot better, not that the high wave wasn't good, uh, although it might look a little bit strange, but you know, 
all the COVID precautions, you know, and I would rather them take the precautions than, um, than, you know, them getting COVID and missing out some dates, which has happened to a few groups and it just sucks, you know, like imagine like I drive eight hours uh, to go see them only to find out the day before that, um, you know, I can't see Dreamcatcher or whatever. So, yeah, I would rather them take the precautions, but it does look a little bit weird. It looks like they're in a cage. They can't do anything. But yeah, anyways, it was still a really fun opportunity. Some say uh, it's a little underwhelming, but in my opinion, even though I was like, like exhausted at the end of that, uh, of the concert, it was still like really fun just to get up close and see them, you know, and because it's always like a thing and uh, like a joke that we play and it's like, are they even real? So just actually seeing them, it's like, yep, Yuhyun's real, Jiyu's real, um, <laughs> they truly exist in this world. Um, and it's just, you know, kind of a, an amazing uh, a one in a lifetime, I feel like, experience that I got there. Uh, for by the fact that I met them twice. <laughs> but yeah, after that, we just went back into the hotel uh, in our in our room, and the the very next morning, it was another eight hour drive back here. Now I made it safe. I made it safe. I'm still alive. I all I'm always scared driving into it, like in the U.S., bro. Like I've had many encounters, uh, like almost near misses like driving and almost all of them have been in the US <laughs> so yeah I'm always scared but I made it in one piece but I'm sick again yeah as you can probably tell my nose is I literally just healed from and recovered from a two week uh, 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 whatever it was um, and literally like a few days literally maybe one day before I like fully recovered and I was like finally I can go see Dreamcatcher um, and I was perfectly fine throughout uh, the three days that I was out and even the Sunday uh, when I came back uh, or I was here but the Sunday I was fine Monday okay and then yeah <laughs> I'm sick again so <laughs> great <laughs> but yeah anyways that was my experience my dream catcher concert experience and I highly recommend you guys go um, to at least one dream catcher concert once in your life uh, you will not regret it it is honestly one of the best experiences I've had um, considering I mean I, I'm I have been to a few concerts now and will be going to a few concerts but every concert has its own unique charm to it and yeah, Dreamcatcher just unique, and um, yeah, it was amazing, absolutely amazing. I can only wish you guys uh, the opportunity to go and see them, seriously. But yeah, anyways, that's gonna be the end of this vlog. Hopefully, you enjoyed. Um, and yeah, I'll see you guys in uh, in my next one. As always, thank you so much for watching. I'll see you guys in the next one.